you know what? When we move to the bigger studio, I'm going to need to get a bigger organ for my mouth. <laughs> and that's the kind of quality entertainment you can look forward to until 2014. <laughs> At least. <laughs> So, are you excited about our new deal, Josh? Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> it sounded like you were just paying lip service to it there, really. I mean, I know you don't have lips, but if you did, you'd be paying no, lip service. I'm just trying to pep it up, just trying to pick up the pace. Yeah! <laughs> you were a little threatened by Bruce, because he was pretty good, is what I'm saying. I wonder if Bruce ever was the spokesperson for oatmeal. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. I... I must admit, I felt a slight Brimley-esque quality in the room and myself. Got a bit of Brimley, got a bit of Brimley. Got a little bit, got a little bit of the old brimley -ish. Do that, Jeff. The old brimley -ish. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you know, when we move to the new studio, you're, you're going to have to uh, figure out where to put your podium. And I'm also going to have to figure out where to stay. Yeah! That's my guy! There you go. That's, that's the kind of thing. Uh, <laughs> all right. What time is it, Jeff? Tonight's Tweet Mail segment is brought to you by Uncle Craig's Late Late Laxatives. Because during this show, a big dump always makes you feel better. You let that go. Let that go. You're, you're bringing down the tone of the show. You're making it a bit... Actually, you're bringing it up a little bit. Uh, play the thing. Um, this is from Marissa in Omaha, Nebraska. You ever been, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. you ever been in Omaha? Yeah, Got a little yeah. place there, maybe? Yeah, like hey, swimming. Hey, Omaha is where I went to that hotel. It was haunted. Remember, I went to that hotel. It was in Omaha, and I went in the room, and it was haunted. Haunted, Jeff. Ooh. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I can't remember the name of the hotel, but it was, uh, I think it was like the Scare Your Pants Off Hotel or something. <laughs> that, was, that was the name of the hotel. <laughs> it is now. All right, uh, Marissa uh, says, Dear Craig and Jeff, my husband never helps cleaning around the house. How can I get him to at least pick up his clothes from the floor? <laughs> well, you could tell him you'll withhold sex. <laughs> and then he'll probably find it somewhere else. CBS care. <laughs> uh, tell me, pick his stuff up. Pick your stuff up, you lazy bastard. Right, Jeff? Yeah, pick it up, you jerk. Yeah, pick it up, you jerk. Do you think you are Wilfred Brimley? <laughs> yeah, I don't mean anything bad about Wilfred Brimley. I'm just saying a, a star by, uh, of the stature of Wilfred Brimley can leave his clothes anywhere he likes because he's Wilfred Brimley. Do you see what I'm saying? Check your blood sugar, check it often. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> You all right there, Bruce? Yeah. All right, yeah, good enough. <laughs> Sean, uh, this is from Sean in Syracuse, New York. You ever been there? Oh, I love it. Yeah, love Syracuse. <laughs> hey, Craig and Jeff, my co-worker likes to listen to music very loudly. How can I poli politely ask her to wear headphones? You say, please wear headphones! <laughs> oh, we get 14 seconds left in all these emails. We've got to go do a speed one. All right, you ready? Juliana in Miami, Florida. Everybody in Florida? Yeah, sure, place there. All right. Dear Craig and Jeff, how do, you, how do you know when it's the right time for the first kiss? Um, you have an erection. Uh, this is... Uh... <laughs> this is from Andrew in Chattanooga, Tennessee. You ever been to Tennessee? Sure, you got another place there? Yeah. All right. Uh, dear Craig and Jeff, when I go out to eat with my girlfriend, she always... It, what? <laughs> oh, I get it. Yeah. Uh, whenever I go out to eat with my girlfriend, she always eats off my plate without asking. What should I do? Uh, just uh, uh, offer her the food. Just give her the food. Give her the food. <laughs> or you can offer to withhold sex. <laughs> and she'll go and eat somewhere else. <laughs> this is from Chuck in San Francisco. You ever been to San Francisco? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, dear Craig and Jeff, is it weird to walk up and talk to someone just because they're wearing the same shirt? Oh, yes, it is. Uh, <laughs> 
This is from Stephen in Manchester, Tennessee. You ever been to Manchester? Uh, uh, hey, Craig and Jeff, I'm renting out my place this summer to people going to a nearby music festival. How likely do you think it will be? Re I'll be returning to a trashed home. Well, it depends. If it's the Dave Matthews Band, it'll be fine. If it's um, like a uh, system of a down. <laughs> They might get a they might get a little uh, anarchic. <laughs> what do you think, Jeff? Are you suggesting that uh, people who go to System of a Down concerts are wild and crazy? That's exactly what I'm suggesting, Jeff. <laughs> uh, I'm just checking. I'm okay, just... all right. Whereas uh, Dave Matthews fans tend to be, you know, hey, that was great. Uh, do you want to uh, get a snack and then go to bed? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and that's during the concert. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's enough. We were